Vitamin D has been known for promoting strong bones, regulating blood pressure, and even improving one's mood. But could it be the key to fighting one of the most deadly cancers? 76-year-old Daryl Fair retired from teaching American politics to travel and spend time with family. But earlier this year, doctors treating him for pneumonia discovered something unexpected. It was a small tumor on the head of the pancreas. Doctors caught Daryl's cancer very early, unusual for pancreatic cancer. Patients often have no early symptoms. Take a deep breath. One, two, three. Because he caught it early, Darrell qualified for a clinical trial testing the impact of vitamin D on treatment. This is not vitamin D that you can get at the drugstore. Researchers found that this potent vitamin D inactivates the body's cells, called stromal cells, seen here in blue. Stromal cells protect and feed pancreatic tumors. Vitamin D uh, acts on these cells to make them quiescent. If the stromal cells aren't working, researchers say chemotherapy drugs will reach the tumors and hopefully wipe out the cancer. For now, patients are receiving vitamin D three times a week. To get the levels, the high levels that we think we need within the tumor, we're giving it IV as the initial trial of this. I think that the studies like this are <clears throat> the things that are going to eventually make uh, cancer readily curable. And bring hope to patients facing a tough battle. Researchers say they'd like to develop an oral form of the synthetic vitamin D so patients in future trials could have the treatment at home. They say the results of this trial may also impact treatment for other stubborn tumors.